All right, everybody, welcome to another live New York session. It is uh, March 3rd, 2023. And uh, so before we get started, we want to check the news for Forex Factory. And um, we see that we actually have uh, some major news at 10 o'clock from the USD. This is the PMI news. Um, depending on how long we're in the market, we might be we might be trading in that or we might be done trading before that news hit. <clears throat> so we'll see about that. So what we're going to do is we're going to trade on NAS 100. And so we're going to trade from the 15-minute time frame to the four-hour time frame. And then we're going to scale back to the 15-minute and then figure out our sniper entry. So let's get started. All right, so let's get started here. So <clears throat> go ahead and put my vertical line in here. And so now I'm going to mark up supply demand market structure. So when we analyze price here, we can see that there was huge supply in this area. But that's what uh, forced price to actually hit this point and then push all the way down. And it changes this to the And then we see that there was major demand down here. <clears throat> That's what made price touch a couple this level a couple of times, push all the way up. And then you can see price hit it here, pushed up to there, and then it just started pushing the border shut down the day. <clears throat> then of course you see a solid <coughs> demand here. Price tested that area multiple times, and it reached this point testing it went up. So and then you see that there was a solid zone there. Very strong seller in this area. That's what push price kept on pushing price down. And then probably we have a very good seller thing down. I mean, uh, supply here. So I'm going to mark my zones in these areas. Basically, we're going to see, <coughs> excuse me. Basically, we're going to repeat this process all the way to the four hour for as much as possible, at least. Um, let me move the man down here. <laughs> Let me move on to the 30 minute. <laughs> 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 so, this is where the last word of the line was. This yes. Moving car. So now we're going to mark up all this here. So there was solid ground here. So we need this green. Price respected it, pushed all the way up to this point to finally get this surprise over to push price to break through this uh, level and then respect it as surprise on. Okay, another solid area here to put price up to there.
Let's see, can I pick my mouth here? I'm going to ask you to do it. Oh, no. Okay. All right, so now let's go on to the other hour. This is where my bed shit far. I'm going to put another bed here. This is where the price is at. I got the four hour here. This is what current times is looking at, but what they might take for out of. All right, so now we're going to go to the two minute. So, <clears throat> looks like <coughs> look at price here. Looks like there's a possibility that price is resting up in this prize or another zone. Now, it's a possibility that it might be. <coughs> Rejecting this area, so it possibly could <clears throat> we test this area and then maybe push up a little bit more, create a swing high, all the way up to here, and then maybe come down. So I'm thinking that price is going to continue to buy it up. Unless price decided this hit the demand zone to go down. And then supply zone, rather. Um, The word says side of the line of the theory. So maybe price might probably be exactly the same, maybe do a swing high and then sell. So you can have all this here. So <coughs> we'll wait until the 9 15 candle closes, which will close in about 22 seconds. So We'll go ahead and just plan our trade here. So I'm thinking price is going to probably sell at this point. So the um, nine fifteen kind of closed just now. <clears throat> so <clears throat> possibility price could come up to test this area to come down. So. If it comes up to this area, and we're going to try to get this much for the first take pop. Um, second target, looking forward to cap that is to put you down here. After breaking this previous low here, we're going to swing low and then push it back up again. So there's a huge demand down here. Um, might even go all the way down to here, maybe swing it right back there. That's what I'm kind of thinking. This might be you know, a perfect for the other side of here. <coughs> and maybe we've got a solid dinner here, maybe. The price could come back all the way down here, swing high and go up. We'll break this, come down here, swing high and go up. So this is what we <coughs> ultimately bring you down here. So this is going to be CP1. Excuse me. Uh, so we got to get caught in COVID. Uh, <coughs> this is 400 plus points. <coughs> and this is going to be CP2. So there's a good point. <laughs> so 
that's what I'm thinking. Price is probably maybe going to sell. So then what I'm going to do now, <coughs> save my progress here. <coughs> and then um, yeah, I'm back. I had to open up my <coughs> MT4 on the computer. I'm going to go ahead and do that. <coughs> But now what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to select you know, as well print the first order. <coughs> um, let's go ahead and so, <coughs> put the line at 15.00. <coughs> and then for uh, my trade on the phone, put it at 16.00. That's what I'm going to do. Let me share my screen real quick on that. Of course, I'm going to trade miles 100, and I got my last size at 16.00. So here, at around 928, I'm going to initiate everything. So that way, we'll be ready for the 930 bell. So, We have uh, less than 11 minutes. Well, less than eight minutes <clears throat> to the 928 period. Once we do that, we're going to initiate everything and then we're going to see what we can do. So stay tuned, guys. Be right back. All right, so it's getting close to 928. So while we're doing this trade, we're going to be focusing on the candle uh, on this chart here. While we're running two trades at the same time, I'm going to do a buy on the MetaTrader for this computer and sell it in the front. Let's see, it's 928. Let's wait a few minutes here. There we go. All right. <clears throat> so now what we're going to do is I'm going to look at both trades and see what happens. So once nine the uh, nine thirty hits, I'll resume this recording and we'll see where we're at. Be right back. So we got about a little, we got less than 20 seconds. So the 930 bell is about to hit. So let's see what happens. Let's get ready. Not that we don't hit. So let's see what happens. It's like a selling in my end. <clears throat> so we're looking at this candle here. Dropping. For example, it's dropping. So let's see. Let's see what happens. Going to get at least three thousand dollar profit on this year. Two thousand, okay, we're close to two thousand. That was dropping. Well, let's go, let's go, let's go. More than a $3,000 profit. <laughs> drop down, drop down. I get my profit, I'll be doing this recording. We'll be right back.
Okay, got the three thousand dollar profit on the first trade. Let me trail the stop loss here in this second here. And modify. There's zero two eight eight point eight. Okay, modify. Two zero five. Then it's not allowing me to modify. What? Okay, you're not. Or two zero. You know, I was going to go ahead and close the second partial trade, which is about seventy-one dollar profit. So we knocked that out. So <clears throat> price sold just like I thought it would. So push me. Yeah. So Freddie went on ahead and close for this one. So let me go ahead and share my phone screen here. As you can see. First partial trade $2,900. Second partial trade $64. So $3,025 profit. The price didn't make sense just like we thought it would, which is good. <laughs> you can see on the MT4 chart here, we did pretty much a good amount of selling. Um, same thing on trading view. So it, it sold a little bit. Possibly, maybe it might be resting on this zone here, and we might be ready to buy it up, or it might continue to sell the difference demand is on. Might do a back testing session on it later to see what it does. <clears throat> but we did decently on that, folks. So <clears throat> that wraps it up. And uh, I will see you guys on Monday for the next New York session. Take care. Bye.